Hello. In this video, I will explain about how to remove the background on a fairly detailed object from this to this. Let's start by deleting the result that I have created earlier. It can be seen. In the hair there are parts that are quite detailed. The first step is right click on the background layer and select layer from background. Click OK button. Create a new background by clicking create new fill or adjustment layer icon and select solid color. Select the desired background color. Here I used a fairly dark color. Move the color fill layer to the bottom of layer 0. Make a selection on the layer 0 by clicking select on the menu bar. Select subject. Wait until the object is successfully selected. It can be seen the selection results on the hair section are still very rough. Therefore, I need a special way to make a selection on this section of hair by clicking lasso tool on the toolbar. You can also use polygonal lasso tool or magnetic lasso tool. Press shift on the keyboard until a plus sign appears on the mouse cursor. Make a selection on the outside of the hair. When finished making the selection, click Select and Mask. A new window will appear. Click the thumbnail view in the Properties section. Select on Layers. Click Refine Edge Brush Tool. Brush the part that intersects with hair. If any part of the object is erased, press ALT on the keyboard and brush again. After finished, in the Output to section, select New Layer with Layer Mask, click OK button. It can be seen. There is still a background attached to the hair details. To solve this problem, the way is, click Create New Fill or Adjustment Layer icon. You can select Brightness slash Contrast Levels or use another option. In here I use Exposure. Right-click on Exposure 1 layer. Select Create Clipping Mask. Set exposure. Set the object to look darker. Double click on the layer mask thumbnail. Click invert button. Click eraser tool on the toolbar. Select soft round brush type. Set opacity and flow. Here I put the value 30 on both. Set the foreground to black. Brush on the section of hair around which it still has the background color.
If any part is too dark, you can return it. Just change the foreground to white. Brush on the desired area. You can also readjust the exposure on that section by double clicking on the exposure one layer thumbnail. Set exposure as needed. Group the layers that have been created to compare the edits with the original photo by selecting all layers by pressing shift on the keyboard. Right click and select group from layers. And here's the comparison. The conclusion is that this method is very suitable to be used to remove the background on objects that have details such as the hair. Thank you for watching. Hope it is useful. Watch our other videos.